A militarized security needs a particular type of masculine identity. It builds and needs and elevates a violent masculinity. It builds and needs women who will support that violent masculinity. I saw it in Ukraine. There were footages of the soldiers going off to the front, being waved off, you know, these great men in uniforms, being waved off by women waving flags, handing flowers. A hundred years since the Women's International League for Peace and Freedom tried to stop that. The image is the same. And not only is that image the same, now we have an additional layer. Militarized security is bringing women into it as actors, as fighters. And I am told that as a feminist, I'm supposed to enjoy that, celebrate it. But equality was supposed to lead to an end to violence, not for us to come in and perpetrate violence as well. That was not it.